It's a pleasure to welcome you today. My name is Nayeon Kwon, in charge of technical support at Suprema HQ. I'm hosting today's webinar. I'll be talking about how to use Suprema Mobile Access with BioStar 2. Especially, I'll be showing you using Suprema Mobile Access on BioLite N2. Today's topic will be particularly beneficial for those who are curious about what devices support Suprema Mobile Access and those who want to use BioStar 2 and Suprema Mobile Access simultaneously. This webinar will run for about 8 minutes. I divided my presentation into two parts. First, I will be looking at which Suprema devices can presently support Suprema Mobile Access. And then, I will be showing you how to use Suprema Mobile Access with BioLite N2 on BioStar 2 through a video. Suprema Mobile Access allows you to use your smartphone as a key to access doors, facilities, and more. Using your smartphone as a credential, managing, and using it as an access card, you will experience that it becomes much easier, faster, and safer. We are planning to expand our supportable devices to facilitate Suprema Mobile Access on all of Suprema's devices. Currently, only XPS2, XPS D2 Revision 2, and BioLite and to support Suprema Mobile Access on these three devices. Regarding the compatible firmware list and the device list for Suprema Mobile Access, please refer to the table on the screen. Each supported device, device has a different version of BARSTA2. Please refer to the on-screen table to install and use the appropriate version of BioStar 2. From BioStar version 2.8.3, Suprema Mobile Access is available on all devices, all supported devices. Additionally, Suprema Mobile Access is not available for XPS D2 unless it's a hardware revised device. If you connect to Suprema Tech Support site, and then check this article later. You can confirm the updated supported device list. We will now watch a video for about four minutes. I recorded the process of the setup and how it is used by BioStar 2 to use in Suprema Mobile Access on the recently added BioLite N2 as a device that supports Suprema Mobile Access. If you want to use Suprema Mobile Access on BioLite N2, please check firmware version. From firmware version 1.3.0, BioLite N2 supports Suprema Mobile Access. Also, you should use at least BioStar version 2.8.3. Go to Alpha portal to create a new site for using Suprema Mobile Access. Click Create Site and set the information for the site. There are two types of mobile access. If you want to use Suprema Mobile Access with BarStar 2, please select regular type. You can see all information related to the site now.
To use Suprema Mobile Access with Barsta 2, go to Barsta 2 and then click Settings, Mobile Access. Turn on the option named Mobile Access Setting to use. And then enter the other values by referring to Alpha Portal site. If you enter the correct all values, you can connect the alpha portal with this message. Now, let's add the BioLite N2 that is already added to Barsta 2 for using Suprema Mobile Access. Click the BioLite N2 and then press Add button below. You can see the device in Device Registration. You can also see the device in Alpha Portal. After registering device, let's issue Prima Mobile Access on Barsta 2. Click Mobile button. You can issue Suprema Mobile Access and its type as CSN card. And you can assign the card number entering manually or using user ID. After assigning Suprema Mobile Access, enter the email address to send the assigned Suprema Mobile Access. You can find the user information that you issued on Barsta 2. You will receive an email on the email address that you entered on Barsta 2 from Mocha. Please download Suprema Mobile Access on your phone. If you download Suprema Mobile Access successfully, the card status changes to activated. After activating the card, if you detect your phone on BioLite N2, you can see Authentication Succeed card in the log page. Today, we've checked the Suprema devices that are available for Suprema Mobile Access. We've also seen a demo setup and how it is used in Barsta 2 to use Prima Mobile Access with N2, the recently added supporting device. I will wrap up today's webinar. Thank you for taking the time to attend the webinar today.